Hey, what's going on, boys? So I guess you're sorry for that for a late video for today. So today we'll be reacting to uh, an update from Glitch, you know, from Glitch themselves about the actual you know, Digital Circus, uh, you know, uh, series. And this is a, this is called Pomni. Wake up! <laughs> Time to go on an adventure. Uh, all right. And as long as we do though, let's get on to it. So I saw like a little image of Pomni on the bed over there uh, from their community uh, community tab. So without any further ado, like I usually say, please go check out the actual video itself. Link will be down below the description itself. So please go check it out. So, uh, yeah, I basically kind of saw this through a different video, or a different video of somebody reacting to it. But, uh, I, I basically knew that it came out, or it was going to come out eventually. But without any further ado, no more rambling, let's just get out to it, no more distractions. So, yeah. Actually, let me dissect a little, little, bit, a little bit of this room. So, overall, uh, I like the, actually, cat, I think that I like the cabinets a lot. I have a cabinet like this inside of my house, uh, but honestly, I don't use it. Uh, little, little hinges and stuff on it. Uh, not though the blocks themselves, but a little bit, um... Almost like, yeah, these are all, these all look like children's toys here on the floors and stuff. And that mirror looks interesting. A little bit older in my opinion. Maybe like a sort of, um, nine, like 90s and like some, not, never mind. But yeah, that's like uh, an older kind of looking mirror, a little older design. And the bed itself looks, oh, it looks grand. It looks, you know, <laughs> it's even got little coverings in it so they don't get disturbed by any lighting and anything like that. That's really cool. Uh, without anything to do. Also, I like the, sand, the chandelier. The chandelier looks really cool, and it looks like it's made. Of, it looks like it made. It looks like it's made out of gold. Without any further ado, let's continue. I'm gonna distract him here. Okay, Palm, he's just <laughs> Palm, he's just looking at this ceiling. Nah, that's how I'd be when I wake up every day. Looking at the red, just. Hey, Palm, me. Guess what? Jeez. No. You're right. This dude, a no. To the amazing digital circus reached our goal of one view, and Bruh. will now be upgraded to episode one of All the right. amazing digital circus Heck whole yeah. series. Nice. Is that how that normally works? Shut up. Yeah. I have so much Damn. to show you. Your little crying face left quite the little okay. crying mark on the internet. Damn. Something I don't canonically have any knowledge of. Take a look. Okay. What? Oh nah. What the f am I looking at? The consequences yeah. of our actions. Ain't that the it's truth? It's only going to get worse from here. Yep. Uh, that's a fact. Oh no. But that's not what I'm here to show you. I'm yeah. here to show you all the cool adventures you and your funny buddies are gonna go on. Ooh. Like this cool candy kingdom. That, why is there a finger with a shotgun? Damn. Let's not forget about minimum wage oh, labor. Oh nah. How about <laughs> minimum wage, wage, wage labor? labor? This isn't finished yet. Don't look. Hi, kid. Oh no. Nah. I'm gonna kill. Huh? What? Why? I read this all dude. the scripts and saw I don't get a single line of dialogue. Well, the moon gets two. Is that I mean, Gooseworks? I guess we could give you some more lines. Okay, never is. mind. I don't want to kill you anymore. Damn. Speaking of dialogue, okay. there will be all <laughs> sorts point. of new dialogue from many of our new colorful characters. Okay. And with Whoa. this many new characters, I'm have to analyze that later on. All the violent shipping wars that we'll be completely powerless to do anything about. Damn. Is is this a cry for help? It might be. What? I see. <laughs> what? I'm locked out. Out of the is bro okay. Uh, you... How can oh. we support the production of this cool That's gross, show? Isabel. Great question, Pomni. All merch sales go right back into funding the show and allow us oh. to do bigger All and the merch. crazier things. But wow, we uh, I've become a pen of it meant getting sold to fund more wacky events. Like Damn. this bubble pin. Bubble. Oh, and pin? this Pomni pin. Damn. <laughs> Pomni too. Can't forget about this. Uh, Me, Plessy. Also available is this cool shirt and digital Ooh. circus sticker Ooh. sheet. That looks like cool. Limited edition vinyl record. A vinyl record? From the digital circus pilot. Yeah, the pilot. I haven't even so cool. mentioned these cool plastic figurines that oh, well adjusted people can be normal and responsible with. These products are only available. Yes, please don't put these in any jars. Any other source is a dirty okay. bootleg and Damn. won't support the show. No matter okay. how <laughs> they look. Ooh. That's digital circus. That's gross. And that's all I have to announce. Okay. Bye. Episodes will, will come out when they are ready. Okay. So, uh, first, let me go back and actually go check out all those uh, amazing people they're going to go and go through. Uh, wars that will be completely. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Playback speed. We're going to go. 
right here. Okay, perfect. Powerless. Here it is. Powerful character. Ugh. Okay. So first we got a little yellow dinosaur uh, dragon thing with a cowboy hat and what looks like a little Lego piece on his hand. I don't know. Oops. What? What the? Oops. Oh wait, so this, I think this might also be part of that episode where there's minimum labor, minimum wage labor. Uh, okay. An interesting character here. It looks like he's made out of balloons or orbs or bubbles or something. Uh, and then, of course, a V8, uh, a little recorder here. Interesting. Oh. A chocolate candy shark? No, crocodile? Oh. A ghost that looks almost like a dog. Oh. Let me guess. Is this... Is this is this Princess Candy or something? <laughs> because honestly, this whole Candy Canyon Kingdom almost distinctly reminded me of the Candy Kingdom from Adventure Time. So honestly, they might have taken inspiration from that. Okay, ghost lady. Nice to see you. What? A mannequin? A blue mannequin here. Okay, interesting. Okay, so... Now, any further ado, that basically concludes <laughs> that this that concludes that segment there. Okay, really interesting characters. Now let me go take a look at that little candy canyon thing. Yeah, that that looks exactly like the Candy Kingdom right there, from the castle and everything go like on. that. Like this. Yeah. Oh, looks even even the walls, even the little walls here look like the Candy Kingdom, with like the little. With candy trees too. This is they're ripping off the Candy Kingdom. I'm just playing. But yeah, overall I love it. It looks so cool. It looks ex exactly like the actual Candy Kingdom in the you know, Adventure Time, and I love that because that's honestly one of my favorite kingdoms ever. A kingdom made out of food. That's so weird to think about. Yeah, like from the pink walls, little candy cane, uh, like uh, how do I call them? Uh, poles or like uh, candy cane? Uh, what are those things called? Uh, I'm, I'm, it's on the tip of my tongue. Um, not statues, not statues. Um, I can't think of anything. Let me know in the comments down below. They're like poles, except they hold up bigger structures, so they're like, uh, like the things that hold up the Greek, you know, uh, buildings and stuff like that. I don't exactly remember the wording for it, but they look exactly like that. And then, of course, you know, little decorations and everything outside of it. And, of course, we got a little something right here in the corner, at the bottom here. Looks like a sort of, uh, candy, uh, Llama or something. Maybe this in places in a candy desert or something. I don't know. Uh, aside from that, though, without any further ado, I'll move on to you guys move on. So, yeah, we might get... Oh, we're going to get probably some... Uh, going to kill you! So, yeah, that's just Gooseworks. I think I think that's just Gooseworks. Uh, but I don't exactly remember their voice and how that went... Or how that sounded. Because it almost sounds like the same thing I heard. It, it, it's from... Exactly... Like I heard for, from an unedited version of uh, of Bubbles' voice. <laughs> and that's just funny to me. Aside from that, though, uh, yeah. So. <laughs> Hold on, let me go down to that. <laughs> oh, nah, the cane merch. No. no. <laughs> the gradual shapeshift, though. Is, is this a cry for help? Okay, that's funny. Okay, without any further ado, that, that does conclude my general thought. My, uh, not, that concludes the actual video itself. Anyways, without any further ado, let me just get into my deeper dive of the actual video itself. Without any further ado, let me just get down to it. I'm going to this. So, yeah, basically, uh, so starting off with the actual design and, uh, of course, you know, the announcements and then going on to the actual, just in general, um, uh, Going on to the actual general merch, actually. Let's get down to it. No so, yeah. Overall, the designs of the characters here look really interesting. I love, you know, the sun. Sun is such a, a interesting character, to say the least. If things don't... <laughs> immediately goes from, I'm gonna kill you, Kane, to... Oh, okay, I got more lines. Okay. Uh, don't worry, Kane. I'm not gonna kill you. <laughs> what is this activity, bro? What is this bipolar activity? This is... It's crazy. That's honestly... That's insane. Aside from that, though, what else isn't insane in this, you know, digital world, though? Uh, but aside from that, though... They know. 
They know. They know about all the fan art and fan art that's been going around the internet about the Amazing Digital Circus. Luckily, I didn't make any. <laughs> okay, but aside from that, though, uh, <laughs> that's unfortunate <laughs> for Bobby and them to see. Uh, <laughs> So yeah, they, bro had to specifically say, bro had to specifically say that I canonically do not know in such a serious voice that is honestly super comedic and funny that I honestly I just enjoyed a ton. But aside from that, though, that interview, like I said, just in general, uh, yeah, the announcements that they you know basically kind of brought up. Um, not only do they mention new merch, but they mention a lot of announcements from the actual you know, si you know digital circus series itself that we're gonna be featuring. Uh, you know, like I said, new characters, new environments, new, you know, situations, uh, minimum wage, <laughs> minimum wage, Jax hits hard, I'm just playing. <laughs> oh my gosh, I was, <laughs> that's funny. But yeah, minimum wage, Pog, <laughs> minimum wage. <laughs> okay, without any further ado though, that's pretty funny. And aside from that though, I can't wait to see these episodes and as soon as they come out, this, honestly just, this series is really entertaining and I can't wait to see it. I, it's just all these, you know, situations pop up. <laughs> Came with a shotgun is scary because bro is like one <laughs> one accident away from going completely bonkers and uh, just abstracting or something. I think that's how it was phrased. But aside from that though, uh, yeah, love it. Of uh, overall, aside from that though, it's getting to the actual merchandise here. Let's get on to it. So yeah, they mentioned the merchandise itself here. It was really cool. I love it. It's just so well done. And overall, it looks really interesting. The just the actual figures themselves. And you know, actual like actual merchandise, like not these sort of I you know off brand shoots. Like hold on, the the pants look amazing. Uh, hold on, where's it? Yeah, the the cane plush, amazing. It looks so cool. <laughs> not like that other one we just saw earlier. But uh, also these amazing digital circus shirts look uh, awesome. They look awesome here. The stickers also are pretty really co are really really cool, and I love them. Aside from that though, um, the vinyl. Honestly, I was expecting something like this because a lot of people have just been taking the footage and it's just there was already like a sort of album release. So, of course, there's probably going to be a vinyl with it. But aside from that, though, love it. So well done. So interesting. And I love the little cover art we got here of Kane just, you know, pulling up a light switch or something like that. That's so cool. Aside from that, though, uh, yeah, these, you know, custom figures. Let's go. Uh, yeah, please do not put these in any kinds of jars. I I bet. Uh, but aside from that though, uh, yeah, love Pomni's design here. It's just so cool, so, so funny. And of course, he's just trembling in fear. Jack's stepping on Bubble, and Bubble's just being A-OK -okay with it. Perfect. Perfect representation of their, you know, uh, of their just energy and stuff like that. As bu Bubble's just the thing you step your foot on, and Bubble's just perfectly fine with it. And Kane is just all too happy to start stepping on Bubble. Anyways, aside from that though, Love the sh love the designs, love everything about the actual just you know uh, figures themselves. They almost look like you know amiibos in a way, which honestly perfectly fits with SMG Four, you know, because they honestly do a lot of content on a lot of you know you know Super Mario Bros stuff, you know, uh, and also feature a lot of you know in you know models from the actual Mario series itself. Uh, well, a lot less now than they did earlier in like a few maybe like a year or two ago, but overall, really interesting nonetheless. Anyway, aside from that though, uh, yeah, this is an overall. Yeah, there's a store, so please go check out their merch. There's a lot of it does kind of go back to the actual series itself. But uh, yeah, 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 that's all the merch and that's the pricing itself. Uh, honestly, all, all, all of these are pretty fair. Though $10 for a sticker pack. Crazy. But I'll forgive it. And it's 30 bucks for you no know, figures. That's okay. Uh, 30 bucks for a plush is all right. Uh, $28 for the you know, t-shirts themselves is okay. Mm. But the, the pins themselves... Being twelve dollars, mm. if it was eleven or ten bucks, I would have understand because honestly, this sticker pack did not need to be ten dollars. Uh, but aside from that, though, honestly, yeah, the most expensive thing on this list here is in fact the actual uh, record itself, uh, including tax and everything like that. It's probably gonna be like you know thirty, maybe like thirty-two dollars, maybe thirty-one dollars. Who knows? Aside from that, though, without any further ado, uh, yeah, honestly, all these merch items are amazing to look at, are really cool, and all rushes in general, really. Really nice with it. Aside from that, though, without any further ado, I do have to say, though, that does kind of actually go through actual videos. So, so, without any further ado, if you're excited for the Edmonton Digital Circus, like I said, please go check out the actual video down below and the link down below. And, of course, at the end card right here. So, please go check it out. And, of course, I'll need that. But also, go ahead and check out some of my other videos right there. And, of course, with all that being said and done, though, uh, yeah, hit the like button, subscribe, helps out so much to the channel, so I appreciate it. So, please consider doing that, of course. Also, go check out that, <laughs> go check out Glitch. They're making a ton of great stuff. And, honestly, I love a lot of their series themselves. Uh, from the actual Meta Run series or Meta Runner series to the actual uh, you know uh, you know killer drones or how did it uh, 
uh, murder drones. Never mind. It was murder drones. I forgot for a second, but I remembered. Yeah, right, right now. And of course, Sunset Paradise. You know, the adventures with um, with Maggie and all that. That's honestly really cool. I love the series itself. I think I've watched most of it actually. Uh, let me see if I watched the last episode here. I haven't watched the actual last episode. I think I watched up to like episode four or five, and then I kind of just uh, stopped. <laughs> but uh, aside from that, though, uh, yeah, like I said. Go check out the extra series itself. They're all really, really, really well done. I'll watch these. They're so funny. And overall, if you like SMG4, you like this series. Anyway, aside from that, though, aside from that, though, um, yeah, that's basically all I have to say. Also, like I said, notification bell. If you want to be notified for any future video, hit the bell icon. And of course, comment down below your thoughts on your you know, video itself. And of course, whether you know, you're buying any of these items or, of course, merchandise. And uh, yeah, without any further ado, that does kind of cool the activity for today. So hopefully, these, you know, <laughs> hopefully, you guys have a great day. And of course, take care of yourself. And I'll be seeing you boys in the next video tomorrow. All right. Bye-bye.